The Mercer men's basketball team took a nine-point loss to UC Chattanooga this weekend. However, the Bears had a chance for a redemption tonight as they hosted the Mocs for a second consecutive meeting. It was a tight battle to start, but the Bears went on a 12-2 run to take an early seven-point lead, which they would hold all the way to the one minute and 30-second mark of the second half when the Mocs finally took their first lead of the game. With the Bears up two with 15 seconds left to play, James Glisson III only makes one of his two free throws and the Bears go up three. They foul UTC's David Jean-Baptiste, who knocks down all his free throws. Bears have a chance to win it here. They go out of bounds and turn it over, and UTC fails to make a game-winning shot on the other end, and we head to overtime. With 20 seconds left in overtime, Kamar Robertson knocks down two free throws, and the Bears are down one. Now this next sequence is pretty crazy. Grant Ledford goes, looks like he has an open layup, completely botches it. Then on the other end, Tucker takes it down, and there's Glisson inside wide open for the dunk, who puts it in, and the Bears go up one. But on the other end, UTC finds A.J. Caldwell in the corner, who makes the game-winning buzzer-beating three to seal the victory for the Mox. Chattanooga wins 74-72. to The Bears do fall to 6-6 six six in conference conference play going one and four in the last five. The Bears are back in action on Thursday at Virginia Military Institute.